Hello. Thank you. Today about enlightenment. Is enlightenment a random one-off event? Or is enlightenment a gradual process? And if so, what is the importance of the path to enlightenment? As usual, these are personal views based on my experience. They are as valid as anyone else's in a way that they help us experience what is directly and progress on our spiritual journey. Keep sharing your personal views and experiences. Back to enlightenment. Does it strike people out of the blue and plunges them deep into the mind all of a sudden? It can happen that people find themselves deep inside the mind following some big trauma or some extreme circumstances. It's usually very unsettling because they have no idea what's going on, no understanding of all the phenomena and all the imagery that is stored inside the still part of the mind. So they can often lose their ground completely. In so-called mental institutions, there are probably a lot of people who have witnessed such an event, but were not equipped to deal with it. And sadly, people who are there to help them usually don't understand these events either and administer large doses of medication. The most natural and safest way towards complete enlightenment is to follow the process as it is unfolding. And this process is called the path to enlightenment. And the path itself is fascinating. People can get addicted to the path. The things they see and hear on the path are like nothing they can possibly experience on a surface level. All the imagery, all the events, past events like past lives or past events from the personal past that they did not understand. And then future events that have not unfolded yet on a surface level. So it's, it's fascinating. People can get very, very engaged with things happening on the path. Sometimes so much so that they spend a lot of time just dwelling on the path and lose the sight completely of the actual aim, which is to get enlightened totally, to become detached from the body, from the human form. I think it's good not to get too engaged with all these different images and events because what is going to happen on the surface level is going to happen anyway. And it's not really that important. That's at least is how I say it. Otherwise, we might just stay there and spend our life there and then have to come back again and again till we find our way across completely. So enjoy the path by all means and do our practice. Keep practicing and the path takes us. But practicing is very important because it takes us deeper and quicker. Enjoy. Take care. Bye-bye.